answer. Because you are that, you are capable. You are gifted and you are so unique. All of the things that you may hate about yourself are your strengths. It's okay to be soft. It's okay to be opinionated. It's okay to be different. And it's so okay to just be The world awaits to receive you. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's do it again. Let's do it one more time. Y'all know me. Bitch, I'm back. I'm popular. Bad girl Sundays. No, it's good girl Sundays. Mr. All over the P, all over the world with his P, Nick Cannon. All right, let's go into Tory Lanes, okay? Um, Now, Y'all gonna be mad because a few people be like if they say this, someone got in trouble. But Boosie got in trouble for saying this. Free Tory Langs, free Tory. It's like no. Well, you know his life is his life. You know, as I say, every dog deserves his day. But um, this is kind of really a tragic story because I think that a lot of things was missing out of this story. And as I talked about this story before, I think all of the parties played a role in this situation and they all should have seen had penalty on them equally so let's just say that okay that's how i feel about this but tory lane is reportedly totally despondent in prison he is very stressed out okay and that's what i tell people here today gone tomorrow i it's so sad the only person you really could depend on is god because all the people that was in his corner i'm not saying his family and stuff like that but sure enough, right now, you had a lot of people that was dealing with him. Sure enough, threw him out. Also, there was a rapper that ended up calling. Oh, wait a minute. After we talk about him, we're going to talk about Jay-Z. Mm-hmm, Mr. Hove. But there was a rapper that allegedly called out Hova, allegedly, for having something to do with him being locked up. Okay? Now, this is not the first time that a, a statement like that has been made such as when his father made the statement when he first got arrested, you know, about the alleged conspiracy behind certain evidence not being um, put in and things like that. So I think, I think I may be going into the Tory Lanes and making the stallion case. How about that? Would y'all like that? I might go into it tonight. I'm thinking about actually doing the YMW, Y is YNW now. I don't know these people, but I like court cases and these rappers acting like a damn fool. It's entertaining. It's entertaining and scary at the same time because they are our people. But later on tonight, I'm going to do, I'll probably go into why in Melly court case, kind of break down a little bit what's going on with that. But um, don't be surprised if I come back with a Tory Lane, make it a Stallion court case breakdown so you can really figure out what happened via the transcripts. So as far as Tory Lane right now, he's very stressed out. Tory Lane is currently being held in jail as he awaits sentencing in the Meg Thee Stallion case. Overall, Tory is looking at a maximum of 19 years in prison. However, it will appear as though the prosecution is trying to fight for 11 to 13. At this time, it remains to be seen how all of this will go. Tory and his legal team have put in multiple appeals. Although the judge continued to uphold the guilty conviction, now Tory wants to add another judge to his legal team. See, they be having retired judges coming in there. That's what Cardi B did. Once again, the judge shot down, according to the legal report, uh, uh, reporter Megan. As the story goes, Tory Lanez wants Ronald Renee Dixon to be on his team. In this role, she will work under Jose Babes, who is one of the most high-profile defendant attorney around. Unfortunately for Dixon, Babes is paying her no mind right now. This subsequently led to her telling Cuffton that she'll, um, she thinks Tory is being taken advantage of. Oh, so they're trying to make it seem like Tory team is is setting him up. Uh oh, 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 wow. Additionally, she says Tori looks totally despondent behind bars and that his eyes are completely black. 
all. Wow. She even went through the trouble of writing a motion to get Tory Lane Bell. So actually, this is a, a white lady. She like, uh-uh, something not right here. What's she seeing in this case that we don't see? I'm going to have to follow this case real quick. I ain't just saying because she's white. But she, she sees something. Tory Lane is due in court today. He got a new lawyer who wants to join the case. I talked to her last night. His eyes were black. He was totally despondent. He told me he wanted to go to state prison. I said, you want to go to state prison? Why? You know why they want to go to state prison? Y'all don't know what goes on in jail. County jail is one of the worst jails to be at because you have a bunch of like puppies, hound dogs, people who don't know what, what they're doing, what's going on, meaning like their cases in, in limbo. So emotionally, they're all over the place. If you have, I'm, I'm going to just keep it real because I have basically been doing a bid with my, my little brother. Y'all know who he is, True Bannon. And when he was in the actual, like, uh, the county prison, he said all they did was fight. It was stabbings. It was just totally off the hook. I mean, the county, like the county type. When you go to prison, I mean, the actual prison, not the county, when they have you in the county versus prison. Prison is more settled. OK, you have people who are already subjected to their time. They're just trying to do their time and get out. People have 20, 30 years, not saying that they don't care about life, but they're they're um, more relaxed in their situation. And a lot of them are about time they get there. They're more mature. I'm just going to be honest. So if y'all don't understand why Tory Lane is saying I would rather be and go to prison than be where he's at. Because people don't understand how it is to be in prison. I have not been in prison, but because I have been doing a consecutive bid with my brother and going through the emotional roller coaster and, you know, just the things that he went, went through just to survive. And not to say it's not their fault. They're not supposed to be in there. But regardless of the situation, you got to understand of the inhumaneness that goes on in these prisons. And it's not really rehab. OK, you know, I got to talk about it. People deserve to do punishment, but this prison system does not have an adequate rehab system across the board. So people are going in there, learning new crimes, uh, getting associated with other things, getting into gangs, okay? Uh, I.e. example, my kid's father, when after I had my daughter, he got locked up, okay? No, just around the time before I had my daughter, okay? He wasn't in no gang, nothing. I'm not gonna say his name. He was 30. No, how was he? 28? No. Yeah, probably like 28, 29. Never in a gang. Went to jail and got in a gang. Okay? I don't know what happened, but I definitely know allegedly somebody needed some protection. And the only way they could get protection is, is joining these type of things because there's no rehabbing going on. So, why I say free Tory Lanez, because I just feel like everyone in this situation played a role and I, it got taken out of hand. There are some things that we may not know about this case. That's why we're going to go into the court case. Y'all shouldn't have let me get paid. Let me just move on forward. I already owe Pacer like $100. Y'all think it's free? It's not free to do that. I'm spending my money so I could go get y'all some of this information. And then I just love the court cases too. You learn a lot. You know, you never know what you got to know in this world. The real estate market often seems like a distant world where only an elite of experts is successful. In a time of so much uncertainty in the air and bad news, realist investing can seem intimidating. But today, I want to tell you that if you make the right decision today, you can enter the real estate market from the back door. Bad credit record? No credit at all. Do you dread the idea of having a home loan? Do you dream of owning investment properties? You are in the right place and right time because we have created a program which is a tax lien and deed investment online course of only 14 hours. This course is specially designed for people like you who have big dreams you will learn at your own pace and everything from your home computer. This is your chance. Join our membership for $19.99 a year. What are you waiting for? Visit our website primetimehomebuyerbuyback.org and sign up today for course access.